Lang and Nisa. Thank you for tuning in with the Enchantress, that is me, the Babbler, that is me, on this evolutionary, revolutionary high of an uproar at this time. So guys, I hit record, um, because I'm obeying spirited thirst, <laughs> wishing to express itself through my vessel, and I'm learning to be more open in my own experience by sharing AAA, which is my life path number here, that car in front of me. Triple A, A A A. It's no debate. Um, what was I saying? So yes, in honor, in full honor and alignment with my finer tunings, with my divine vessel, my divine consciousness that is awakened and responsive at this time line in this timeline that is awakened alert here you know whatever this is here my finer tuning in station guides me or maybe it's the schizo inside of me that tells me to press record and so here I am pressing record opening another portal door of healing that comes from this leveling of revealing that happens here if you fail to see, this is my heart bleeding before you. This is me driving. I'm not on my knees. <laughs> um, Many people that I um, work with or, or those that um, come to me, you know, um, have gone through it <laughs> in life. Whatever shape or form that they're gone through was, they're gone through was. And it's always been that way. And up until I bring up my history, if you check out Bad at Love Parts 1 and 2, you can get the reference to our timeline. And even if you don't want to go beyond this level of existence and just speak of this lifetime that you are conscious of and that you can vouch for in your perception, you know, because that's all a matter of mind funks, you know. Um, that's a deep throat, though, so we're not going to go there in this video. <laughs> um, you know... <laughs> sometimes but anyways um everything is a matter of perception of whatever reality you believe you exist on or in or whatever it is that you're journeying to to comprehend for you that is for you um you know everything 
contributes to everything collectively, of course, because this is a shared space environment, but infinite is space. And that's another video of just understanding, understanding, overstanding that if you wanted to move your space into a private space, even in an external place that is filled with others and things surrounding that in 3D reality would make you feel as though you are like a sardine cesspool of bodies and energies all around and no room you can occupy another space in space in that same space of a place and be okay time travel it's cool space travel it's awesome higher octaves of perspectives and processing dope <laughs> but yeah so either way in alignment and realizing you know when you connect all kind of dots or you're trying to make sense of something compute something dissect something inspect something understand something understand something um overstand something depending on the leveling of your interest um curiosity um the evolution <laughs> it's all a matter of everything you know um, what I've come to realize a little bit more harder and I guess you know because again it's not you 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 get the full evolution of uh, understanding of something over time because infinite is everything anything nothing something so like the moment your curiosity is peaked in any kind of thing even if it's a person or whatever the curiouser you are the evolution of that curiosity will continue to grow over time it's the natural process of that kind of vibration, frequency, energy that's creating something through its own frequency of fields that creates, you know, these, these realities that be most real, you know, for all of us. Oh, shit. I didn't realize I have my beamers on. Those, those flashies? Either way, what was I going to say? Um, most times when people encounter me in any kind of leveling of a deeper level of degree like this is not superficially they never would guess my history Or trauma by meeting me by, by, by first meeting me and yeah trauma victim you know or Whatever. Or just, you know, disassociation with a lot of like reality and self and just, you know, not happy. I draw that. If we look at the 
my timeline, my history, you can understand why that would be in my auric field of attraction. Even though that's not what I'm attracting. It's just magnetic. It's just a whole bunch of things that just are pieced together in one serving that just is. It's just like when people be like, oh, that's, that's, that's negative, that's positive. You're giving it the negative and positive. Negative and positive exist regardless if you charge it or not. Identify it or not. Like, you know, like, that's going off too. But there's just so many things that filter through a lot. And just, you know, anyways, coming to, like, focus. I'm always asked. How can I be so positive? How can it not, like, how can I not be depressed or not in pain or, like, how did I deal? Like, how did this all go away? Like, how did I do it? Like, you know, all these questions. And clearly, you know, in my in my vocabulary, in my speech, you can hear the positivist in me, existing in me, which is constant. Um, the balancing act of all of it for even just myself as an individual who has to go through, to get through, to rise up, to, you know, that's what's up. You know, and then to be able to articulate it in a way, in a form of expression that is understandable, understandable, like relatable, helpful. You know, there's a lot to all of what we do in everything that we do. We are the solution. To everything we seek. Go ahead, go, buddy. You're like a thirst bucket. Okay? It's all a matter of perspectives and octaves and choices and all this kind of stuff. But anyways, this is 13 minutes too long and I don't even know what is the message of this song. What should this title be? <coughs> what is anything? The whole spirited message was that I'm just in full alignment with self and realizing that there are things, there are gifts from this well that are coming up as are with you. And... um my ability to allow them to stream through and release and express it's a beautiful thing yeah that's it bye